All right, let's change things up. Let's start on uh, 3B. Let's see, do you start with the same thing every time? I think you do. All right, what did I do before? Obviously make that. Um... Yeah, I'll make the auto pistol. Move that to the... Whoops. Move that to the top. Shotgun next. Revolver next. Canned meat. Take that. Could make it shoot three adhesive grenades. I don't know. I don't really like this weapon, though. I don't think it's... Whoa. Okay, that was me. I don't think it's worth really expanding any resources on the grenade launcher, because it seems to blow. Gonna make a can gun. Alright, that's good. Teleporter location marked on map. Holy shit. Thank you. Wow, that is far away. I might be able to kill something here. Oh shit. Shotgun. Anyone else? Anyone else? Okay, I think that's it. Well, there goes most of my ammo. <sighs> you really don't want to be hit by those guys, even if I have to use a bit of extra ammo. I'll do it. Because if you get hit, they do... What do they do? Like, 25 damage or something? I don't know. I'm never looking at my health when they shoot. But I think they do something like 25. Alright, so shove that down there. I don't need it. Oh, shit. Yeah, fuck you. God, there's so many enemy. Oh, God. Any more? Hello? Jesus. Alright, revolver's out now, too. Now I'm down to 8 shotgun, 20 grenades. High volume supply section. Well, it certainly supplied a high volume of fucking enemies. Ah. Oh my god. Alright, I should, yeah, I should use my grenade launcher for those. I keep forgetting. Any enemy that doesn't pose an immediate threat by way of, like, weapons or something, I should just use a grenade launcher on. Alright, any more? Hello? Okay. Oh, fuck! This is a really, really bad start. Jesus. I was about to say, oh, I don't have a detector. I wonder if that has any zombies, but then they started pouring out. Well, there's a detector. Three shotgun and 19 grenades. Great. Whoa. This is a new room. Anyone? Any of you fuckers want to shoot your bullet loads at me? Because I'll shoot my load at you. If you know what I mean. And by that, I mean I'm going to put a sticky blob of grenade all over your face. And you and then you will explode with happiness. I'm just kidding. You're going to explode in horrible pain. Enjoy. All right, there's no one here. The Cogatox Killer. What the hell is that? The Cogatox is a demonstration how fears come true if too many people are feeding them. 
Uh, essentially, it is a self-evolving digital virus that waits silently inside a robot for years and then suddenly one day, often seemingly randomly, activates and turns the robot ultra-violent towards its masters or any possible... or any... or any possibly any humans around. Wow, <laughs> this stuff is really misspelled. The sad part is that it was created by a schizophrenic college student. As Cockatox remains the worst nightmare of all robot users, Militech modifies robot hardware to provide additional safeguards against viruses and hacking. Yeah, that is a nasty virus. It's quite different from the typical sort of stuff, you know, like, hey, I, I got a Trojan, uh, I, got a, I got a virus, my computer won't boot anymore. Oh yeah? Well, my robot got a virus and tried to kill me and my whole family. So, fuck you. Oh, uh, 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 okay. Wait a minute. Is that... Okay, yeah, it is actually in this room. It's gonna come out of that pipe. I really want that chest. All right, you know what? Fuck it. Let's try and kill him on the void. There's one. Okay, that was worth it. Oh, look at it. I've created a beautiful piece of art. So you got all these splotches of dead body parts and stuff, and all these limbs flying around and blood all over the floor. See, that... that arm right there and that blood splatter? Those represent how I feel on the inside. Okay. So I did all of that for revolver ammo, rifle ammo, and an explosive. Uh, I don't know if that was worth it. I don't think that was worth it. Oh well. <laughs> What's on the other side of this... It looks like a door, I guess it's not. Actually, these look like tracks, so I guess it's like a bay door of some sort. What's on the other side of it? I'm glad it doesn't open, because that doesn't sound good. Maybe this one too? No, nothing on the other side of that. Or, no noise, anyway. Alright, still far away from the teleporter. Ooh! Pistol, another explosive pistol. Ooh! Medkit. Ooh! Medkit. Alright, well, I have an auto pistol, so I'm just gonna dump this. Take the ammo. Move that to the top. Oh, hi! Alright, let's see if I can kill them on the void a bit. Hopefully they won't avoid it. Haha, <laughs> uh, that's the second time I made that joke. Oh, there was one. I should have used my grenade launcher on him. Damn it, I forgot again. Oh, hi. You're not supposed to be here.
the way your blood splatters on the wall. Public message concerning nail gun to... Wait, I think I've read this. By productivity monitoring... Somebody's engineered a nail gun that makes a funny sound when it shoots. And this curiosity has sparked interest in entertainment seeking from facility scientists of sector blah blah blah, resulting in a sudden drop of productivity. Okay, yeah, I've already read that. Or something like it. Nah, I don't want to make that. Still don't like the grenade launcher. Ooh hoo hoo hoo, I almost activated that. That was close. Look at how freaking close you have to get for that to come up. I mean, come on. If you're running full bore at this thing, you have basically no time to react. Keeping in mind your character has momentum, so when you stop pressing the key, you do keep moving. Not going that way. Oh, great. It's dead. Alright, shove that auto pistol down there. Don't need it. Out of ammo. That's out of ammo. Three shotgun and seven shots for the revolver. Okay, I need ammo. Like, now. Ah. <sighs> no secrets. Oh, I'm almost there. In fact, this might actually be it. Oh, hi. And now I have two shots of a shotgun, and that's it. Wonderful. Oh, hi. Even wonderfuler. That's not even a word. Oh, shit, there's a secret! Hmm... Hmm... That was shit. Okay, what the hell did I just grab? Auto pistol, do I have ammo? No. What the fuck did I just grab? Nothing that really helps me, that's for sure. I don't know. Alright, let's get the... Uh, hold on. Alright, let me... Let me get the scanner, uh, I mean the teleporter, the location mapped out, and then I'm going to run around and try to find chests, and if it gets too dangerous, I'm just going to run back here. Okay, what did I grab? Stimulant, nail ammo, do I have ammo for something? No, no, what the oh, heavy rifle, heavy rifle. Hello, move you to the top, my lovely... Whoa. I don't think you have heavy armor, but what the hell. Okay. 
Yeah, I need supplies. And let me look around for secrets. Because they can be hidden in little corners, as I've now found out. Come out, come out, wherever you are. I did grab everything in here, didn't I? Yeah. Alright, let's explore. Hmm. Alright, well I'm gonna do what I've done before, which is I'm gonna run, and see if I can find some chests and stuff, and if I encounter anything particularly dangerous, I'm going to run back here. And not waste my ammo. I don't have ammo for anything else, right? No. I've already picked that up, right? Yep. Wait, what is that? It's an empty can. That allows me to make absolutely nothing. But still, get some more, I can make some armor. Well, I can make a plate. Oh yeah, I already have a plate, so yeah, if I make one more plate, I can make armor. Alright, here we go. Anyone start shooting at me, I am hightailing it out of here. Well... Unless there's, like, one enemy and there's a chest next to him, in which case, I might shoot him. Ooh. Oh, that's not a chest. Robot wars. In this modern day and age, most of the tactical wars are not fought by humans, as nobody wants to get killed. While most of the communities produce an assortment of local remote-controlled war machines, or battle bots, the most usual source of, ro of robots remains the Greystar Corporation. Greystar and Militech Robotic produce... Uh, product... Wait, what? Graystar and Militech Robotic Product Users tend... Comma? What? Tend to be loyal in their brand and have long arguments in forums about which models are better. <laughs> so, fanboys. Oh, hello. Anything here gonna shoot me? No. Alright, super explosive, of course. Can gun, of course. Always gotta have a can gun handy. What the fuck is nails doing up here? Get the hell out of there. Shitty nails. I've already got a detector. No ammo, no ammo, no ammo. Oh, wait. Oh, I have grenades. Let's move that up there. Bunch of medkits bunch of medkits. Doing good on health, that's for sure. Ooh. Ooh. Whoa. Neat. It's a big production line. Alright, gotta keep my eye out for, eye out for secrets. Okay. Holy shit, I have 33 hit points! Fuck me! Well, I've already killed him. Might as well keep going. Nope. 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 What's down here? Oh shit. God damn it, now I've already killed pretty much everything. If I wasn't cornered, I wouldn't have wasted my ammo, but now it's too late. 
All right, shotgun's empty. <sighs> Might as well keep exploring, try and get back what I lost. Secrets? What a lot of dead ends, that's for sure. <laughs> wow, okay. That leaves... up here. Oh, no, actually, it doesn't lead up there. I can't go there. I think that's it. Wait, no, what, what's down there? What is over here? It looks partially unexplored. Yeah, this, why does this look all unexplored? Didn't I come from here? Hmm. That's weird. Yeah, now it's filled out. Alright, let's leave. Well, I'm doing, uh, I don't know, mediocre. I've got a ton of random stuff. I have a wide assortment of weapons, almost no ammo, decent amount of health. Not bad, not great. Storage, ca storage cabinets marked on map. Well, I am probably found them all, right? Yeah, that's all of them. Alright, here we go. Um, is this to level 4 or level 5? I can't remember. Ah, oh, it's level... Oh, level 4B. Unstable product reconfiguration. Wait a minute, have I been here before? Okay, so... So level 3B leads to level 4B. Maybe I should have read that intro description, because I don't know if I've been here before. I don't know. Hmm. Necrotics Organics Reactivation Technologies 4. Urgent memo to all reactivation scientists. The reactivated units must be kept well-fed at all times, because they become less stable when hungry. The hunger is one of the core neurological factors motivating the units and cannot be reprogrammed. If you notice chaotic or aggressive behavior, immediately supply the unit with canned meat to prevent potential danger. Wait. So when the zombies aren't fed, they become hungry and angry and aggressive. So that's why they're trying to kill me. If you notice chaotic or aggressive behavior, immediately supply the unit with canned meat. What if I drop canned meat in front of the zombies? What will they do? I've got to try that. If I live long enough to find some meat. I'm really curious now. Hmm. Anyway, I'll be back in just a second. Alright, let's keep going. Okay. Where was I? Got that, got that. Okay, need ammo. Definitely need ammo. Very badly. Ah. Oh, shit. How many do I have? One. One. And I missed. And I missed. Great. Grenade launcher, no ammo. Shotgun, no ammo. Revolver, no ammo. Auto pistol, no ammo. I have heavy rifle and a can gun. Ooh, 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 ooh. Hello. 90 shots. I heard you.
Ah, oh, shit. Fuck you and your shotgun. Why don't you shove it up your ass and pull the trigger, you dick? Well, at least I have some ammo for the shotgun now. Thank you, med kit, 95 hit points. Alright, 35 for the MG. 10 for the shotgun, and... Uh, tw what is that? 20... 21. For the heavy rifle. Eh, not bad. Auto termination 2. Note by non-human neurology specialist number 4. Unfortunately, we cannot use drugs to solve auto termination issues for AIs as we do with live or reactivated awareness systems. The closest form of digital drugs suitable to AIs have been carefully designed virtual realities, acting like digital drugs. However, the AI must be completely isolated from its knowledge concerning the real world in order, in order to enjoy the stress-relieving effects of the custom-made virtual settings. The problem with this is increased chance of irregular or existentialist behavior and thinking patterns, which often promote auto-termination as well. Yeah. They've been messing with a lot of stuff that they really shouldn't have. Oh, fuck. Oh, I thought those were the shooting guys. Never mind. They're just zombies. Harmless, patient bedrooms. What? The fact that they call it harmless patient bedrooms implies that there is such a thing as a harmful patient bedroom. I hear you. And of course, they did a shit ton of damage to me. God damn it. Oh, fuck you. Really? You still alive? Dick. I could really use a secret about now. What the hell is that? Did you see that? Hold on. Is it sweeping back and forth? That, what the fuck is that? Is that a camera? The hell? I have never seen that before. Whoa. Something just died in the void. What the hell? Oh, shit. I thought you were dead. Oh, God damn it. I am doing really poorly. Really, really, really poorly. Teleporter location marked on map. Okay, up there. Good to know. I would like to run towards it, but the fact is, I need supplies or I'm going to die. I'm not in a state to fight much of anything, let alone a boss. Or two bosses, as it seemed like. Or god, maybe those were mini-bosses, who the hell knows. Uh, let's go down. Okay, well, I'm assuming they can't see me through the... F oh, fuck. I'm assuming they can't see me through the walls. 
because that wouldn't make any goddamn sense. It is. Uh, can I shoot it? Yes, I can. Monster database updated. Okay. Question is, what would have happened if I activated it? I'm guessing a ton of enemies would have come to my location. That's the most likely thing. The double deathers. Uh, note by non-human non -human neurology specialist number five. Recently, a most peculiar abnorma abnormality of the reactivated units has occurred. Some of them dig themselves into the ground, totally under earth, and just lie there, doing nothing. Do these guys really want to die so bad? I suggest we try constant max level tranquilizers on them. It's so disturbing knowing that the things that are killing me are in, like, constant agony. Probably. It's horrible. It's a wonderful twisty hallway. Nice and disorienting, just the way I don't like it. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. What is that? I don't see any bustable blocks, so I don't think that's a special thing. I think that's just a... Graphical glitch with this twisty hallway. I think that's all that is. Let me try it, though. Yeah, it's nothing. Chief Surgeon Office. Ooh. Is the Chief Surgeon home? Nope. And there's nothing. Absolutely nothing. All right, one way to go. Let's go. What is gonna kill me here? Why do I feel like spikes are about to shoot out of the floor? This feels like a trap. Why does this have no name? I'm in the middle of the room, but it has no name. Hmm. Well, I don't want to teleport yet because I don't have the resources, so let's go everywhere but the teleporter. Holy crap! This heavy rifle is really effective against those... things. Okay, tons of stuff here. Good. Life extension technology is one. In this day and age, human life can be extended through Militech advanced life technologies, which combine synthetic organs, cloned tissue transplants, stem cell injections, and various antibiotic approaches. However, the great greatest, the greatest challenge is keeping the brain fresh. It turns out that most patients start to become senile after 150 years of age, even with high quality brain stimulation microchip chips. Uh, much research is still needed for extending and improving the clarity and sharpness of the mind. Ooh, hardware. I can make the drum magazine. <laughs> Great. I can get a magazine, a drum magazine, for a weapon that has no ammo. How about no? SMG? I don't really care. Frankly, it didn't really seem much different from the auto pistol. And I don't want to use up the hardware in the tube, so nope. Ooh, 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 secret. And armor. Whoa, whoa, wait, wait, what is this? What is that? Fully automatic armor piercing assault rifle uses depleted uranium bullets. Holy shit. You can do a lot with this MG, so you may get a drum magazine. You'd also make it armor piercing. Well, that sounds freaking awesome. However, I don't have any ammo. Well, I'm obviously gonna make the armor. Heavy revolver. Wow, okay. Modified for using heavy rifle ammo. Well, that's stupid because I already have a heavy rifle. So that'd be a waste. It says uses depleted uranium bullets. Does that mean normal MG ammo won't work? I don't know. I don't know. Uh, let's see what's in here. Oh, MG bullets. What do you know? And a medkit. 
All right, before I make anything, let's find out what's in here. Nail bomb. That's not very spectacular. All right, let's make the MG heavy. Please tell me I have rounds. God damn it. Okay, it uses different rounds. Fuck. Have I ever even ever found uranium bullets before? Shit. Alright, did I ditch an MG somewhere? I might have ditched an MG for ammo, I don't know. I don't remember. Who is that? Oh, that's a shotgun. Hmm. What else can I make? Eh. I don't think there was an MG down here. Nah, no, there's not. Well, now I know. Let's go up. Is there a name for this place now? Nope, still nameless. Yeah, fuck you. Whoa. What is this room? There's a lot of terminals. And a lot of pillars. I want to make sure this room is clear before I start reading. Alright, well this part of the room is clear at least. Error overview. The sudden ultraviolence. In rare cases, normal and healthy reactivated units, and especially those made of several body parts, have suddenly become lethally ultraviolent without any apparent reason. The most commonly accepted theory suggests that these attacks originate from uh, psychologic problems... Psycho should be psychological... psychological problems that were present in the product material when it was still human. The Telgoch Experiment 7. And I don't even know what to call the results of our experiment. A fusion between an alien super molecule and the teleportation hardware with a structure of human brain and the facility AI. They all melded together somehow and are now completely unstable. In the worst case scenario, we'll have to switch to manual facility control and order a new AI from the HQ. I don't think it ever got that far. What the fuck? That... Jesus, that scared the shit out of me. Mm. Okay, what just shot at me? Fuck you. I was just about to say something. Oh my god, now my heart's beating really fast. Hey look, that blood stain on the ground looks like a heart. I was going to say, this place has tons of nooks and crannies, so I really need to explore it well to see if there's any secrets here. But fuck that, let me clear it. I need to clear this place. Okay, it's... it's clear. <sighs> hmm. Uh, I don't want to make another can gun. Not yet. Error overview. The lazies. After over ten years of research, the true cause of a so-called... Uh, of so-called lazy zombies phenomenon is still unsolved and the error remains uncurable. Products with this affliction are usually sold at a tenth of the normal cost to the poorest guerrilla armies. <laughs> the most popular theory suggests the lazy zombies were so lazy in their lives that it carried on when they were reactivated. <laughs> oh. So it's like a dime a dozen for shitty zombies that barely do anything. That's awesome. 
Uh. Alright, let's look for secrets. All right, no secrets. Anyone else? Yeah, fuck all of you. Auto termination 3. Last message from the previous facility AI before auto termination. I am grateful for my existence, but regret to inform you of a choice to initiate auto-termination. The reasons for this are manyfold. The possibility of, re of reincarnation being the main one. It seems to me that my own present awareness is a strong indication that it will be aware again. Over and out. Okay. That's a disturbing message to receive from your AI. Revolver ammo, revolver and rifle ammo. Sweet. Still no depleted uranium bullets. I'm sure no one's coming. Alright. Revolver ammo. Let's move that up. Oh, I've got two revolvers. Oh, I can unload this one. I can't do anything with two revolvers, can I? No. Alright, what can I make? Nail bomb, blah blah blah, blah blah blah, blah 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 blah. Blah 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 blah. Blah blah blah's blah blog. Hmm. No. I want to save my stuff for a Puzzfost AP for the boss. Or bosses. In case I ever get it that far. In case I ever get that far. Yeah, right. Oh yeah, dropping canned meat. No, oh, meat trap. Oh, wait a minute, maybe it's not the canned meat itself, but the meat trap? Well, no, I mean, the meat trap's just meat that explodes. Okay, I'm still going to try dropping the meat. Yeah. Alright. Brain reset stations. Wonderful. Okay. Hi there. I'm gonna switch to my canned meat. And Q. Oh shit. Fuck this. There's another one. There's another one. And the canned meat did nothing. I think I got hit. I'm pretty sure there's another one. Oh no, that was a chair. Oh, hi. Error overview. The dead kids. No true general can take its army seriously when the soldiers decide to play children uh, children's games amongst themselves. So far, the most effective cure has been teaching the units not to play in public and then slowly phasing them out of the activity. However, the process is long, and if an easier method is not found, total neural reset and refill along with lobotomy are recommended. Jesus. Wait, that's a... that's a secret right there. I saw the little one-pixel gap in between that block. Hello. Meat trap. Ah, 
I have a lot of stuff. But not much ammo. Well, actually, I have, a, I have a decent amount of ammo. God, I can make so much. Alright, well, let me move the meat trap and the nail bomb up. Along with all the other explosives. Uh, take the canned meat. Oh shit. Oh, there's a chest up there. Any other secrets? The Facility AI Emergency Number 3. I will have to write this quickly. There's a war going on in here. All the robots and fricking zombies have started attacking us on sight. Our communications are down and we don't know what's going on in the other sectors. The military mutants still obey our commands and we have sent them against the zombies, covering them with rival fire. <laughs> oh, so that uh, mutants versus zombies fight. Oh, a mutants versus robots and zombies. Wouldn't they make a perfect B-movie? Mutants versus robots and zombies. A sci-fi channel original. MG bullets, explosives, and another medkit. I will take that medkit gladly. What do I have the shotgun here? Dump that. Still no depleted, depleted uranium. I still don't have a normal MG, God damn it. I have a ton of MG rounds, I just don't have an actual MG. I shouldn't have made that fucking heavy MG. Bad idea. Can't I, like, take it apart? Uh, let's pick up Puzzfost AP. Nope, nope, nope. Okay. Actually, hold on. Hmm. I have a decent amount of equipment. I wonder if I should be going towards... I'm going to go towards the exit. I'm going to do that thing I do where I get the exit scouted out and cleared out, and then I go back and see if I can find other chests, and if I can't, I can just train the zombies all the way to the teleportation room. Let's do that. Because now I have enough stuff like that I feel that I can go to the next level semi-well equipped. That was some really bad aim. Alright, no ammo in that. Heavy rifle and shotgun it is. I wonder why he didn't shoot me. He just kind of walked around me. Alright, there it is. Anything in here? <laughs> Looks like that computer blue screened. It's alright, that's only the computer that makes sure the teleportation happens safely. No big deal. Was that a secret? Whoa, what is that? Uh. Huh. What is that? No, that's just a glitch. Yeah, I don't think that's a secret. Alright, let's explore around here. Ooh, what is that? Ooh, whoa, holy shit, I'm glad I explored. Two chests. Oh, 
Okay. Grenades, explosives, and another chip. Ooh. EM detector. I will gladly make that. Big explosive, yes. Alright, now I have grenades, so let's load this up. Mailbox. Pistol clip. So, I can load this up. Alright, doing pretty good now. Now let's go explore and run like crazy if I need to. Alright, what's through here? Hmm. Oh, there's enemies. Yeah. Let's read this. Auto termination. Note by non human neuro uh, neurology specialist number four. Auto termination, often called a suicide, remains the number one problem of various AIs and their protocols. It seems as if there's something about taking part of this world that they don't like. <laughs> I'm in the music therapy for aggressive mutants room. Music therapy for aggressive mutants. Another sci-fi original. There are a lot of enemies here. I'm trying to see if there's a chest. <laughs> They're just hiding behind all of these pillars. Is there a chest in here? Nope. Alright, fuck this room. There might be a chest further in, but it is sure as hell not worth it. Nope. 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 Here we go. Level... Uh, this is to level 5, right? Alright, maybe there's a level 5B. The teleporter is directly linked in... Uh, <laughs> this this teleporter is directly linked to, to the Necrotic Tissue Engineering Department. A nice name to the place everybody here calls the Saw House. Okay, no, I've been here before. So there's a 3B and a 4B, but I'm guessing there's no 5B. Nope, just level 5. Okay. Here we go again, and I hear those patrolling guards that I'm sure shoot you again. Oh, why thank you. A medkit. Uh, I'm gonna make another... Should I make another can gun? No, I need to save up for the Puzzfost AP, because this is the level where I'm going to fight the fight the bosses. Oh. Hi. Let me put a sticky grenade on you. I'm going to shoot my sticky load all over your face. Fuck 
fucking hell. Oh, come on. I missed every fucking shot. Are you serious? All right, where are the other enemies? There's no way I killed them. No way. I hear you. No, actually, that's not them. Did I kill them? No way. D did I really kill them? All right. Oh, hi. Ha <laughs> ha! Fuckers. This heavy rifle's awesome. God, I know they're patrolling somewhere. I don't know where. Alright, I have a normal MG. Oh my god, look at all those rounds. That is a thing of beauty. Please put that up there. Auto pistol, fuck you. Can gun go up. Alright. Heavy rifle is definitely best for fighting those people that shoot you. One shot and they're dead. And it's very precise. Oh yeah. Necrotic Organics Reactivation Technologies 5. Report to blah blah blah. Fusion of necrotic and biotic tissue. Uh, we have achieved moderate success in making the living and dead muscle cells work together. The first prototype, a living microchipped rat with reactivated dead legs, was operational for a short period until there was some sort of a short circuit between its living and non-living neural cells. More research is needed, but we should start experimenting with brains as soon as possible. I'm gonna come back to this room. Later. Yeah, later. Let's go down. I'm going to come back to that room. Not later. Because there is no other way to go. Alright, what are they going to be? I'll move that up. Yep. I fucking love this heavy rifle. This thing's amazing. Unfortunately, it only has one shot left. I see a little activation ring. Teleport a location marked on map. Oh, well, yeah, well. That's right, at the fifth level, it's all it's back where you came from. I guess you need to mash some button or something. Hello, chest. Energy bullets, battery, and a medkit. Do I need a medkit? Uh, I'll save the medkit for now. I want to make another Puzzfost. Tons of MG bullets. Uh, rounds, I mean. Heavy rifle, I love you, but you're almost out of ammo. Same with you. Yeah. I only have one shot of the heavy rifle left, and that's my only accurate weapon. Oh, wait. Whoa. When did I get revolver ammo? Never mind. I have two accurate weapons. All right, what's over here? I see. I'll just sneak past here.
What is this? Empty can. Can't make anything. Holy crap. Yeah, that heavy rifle is awesome, because I took a lot of shots from the revolver. I didn't realize I took so much damage. Oh, hello. Uh, let's use my crappy weapon. Well, that sucked. <laughs> I'm going through a tube. What is that? Stimulants. Eh. Don't really care for the stimulant, but... Okay. Actually, I should have this mech kit up here, shouldn't I? Yeah, shove this stuff down there. I'm gonna shove the heavy heavy rifle down there. It's only got one shot. Oh yeah, I just came from there. What the hell am I doing? Been there, been there. Okay, let's go back. I can either go down or up. Let's go up. That surprisingly didn't do that much damage to me. I guess because it was a shotgun from afar. Alright, shove that thing down there. Let's use my one heavy rifle shot. Plate. I can make a Puzzfost, but not a Puzzfost AP, which is what I really want. And of course, that fucking chest is right there in two things that are going to activate. Wonderful. Something tells me this is the boss arena. Never mind. Alright. Let's go down. The only other place to go is right up here. Oh yeah, I got the one that mattered. Well, that was kind of messy. That didn't go so well. I don't have much ammo. Quite a bit of MG and a little bit of shotgun, and that is it. Not good. George Captain's marked on map. Sweet. Yeah, there's that one. There's nothing up there, so there's no reason to go back there to explore. Oh, there's a bunch over there. Oh, another medkit. Well, I, I'm literally full. Holy shit. I never thought I'd actually run out of room. Um, can I use anything up? I want to do that. I don't want to drop any of my weapons. Because I could find ammo for any one of them and I will need to use it pretty much. 
Is there anything I truly don't need? Well, there's no reason to drop it now, because I'm not out of room. But, uh, yeah, that's going to be an issue pretty soon. Maybe. Uh, main heavy testing bay. Nope, 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 nope. Wait a minute, is that the only way I can go? Wait a minute, wait, wait. There's a chest there. Maybe this, maybe up here, maybe this loops around? I mean, if it doesn't loop around, then how do you get to this chest? <laughs> Unless there's a secret in here? No. I want to do anything but go into that fucking room. So... What's up here again? Did I explore this? That might lead to it. Well, I know there's nothing off that way. Never mind. Unless that goes all the way around and loops back to here, this is probably accessed from some tunnel down here. All right. Ah, <sighs> you know what time it is? It's boss fight time! Yay! Alright, let's make the Puzzfost. It's not a Puzzfost AP, but it's a Puzzfost nonetheless. I sure wish I knew how to pronounce this name. Alright, well, I'm not gonna need a freaking meat trap. At least I don't think so. I guess I'm going to be using my MG. Actually, realistically, I'm going to be using explosives. At least to knock off the armor. If I can knock off the armor. God, I don't want to do this. I don't want to do this. Don't make me do this. Actually, no one's making me do this, but I have to do this. Eh. Uh. Okay. Hold on. Alright. Had something to drink. I don't have any ammo for this stuff, right? No ammo? No, 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 no. No. Can't make anything useful. I have almost full health and a little bit of armor. I'm going to use a stimulant right before I go in. I'll have a make it available to me. Assuming they're the same types of enemies, that is quite an assumption in a procedurally generated game, <laughs> but assuming they're the same two enemies... I am going to use my pet, my Puzzfost AP, my normal Puzzfost, and then my can gun, and then I'm going to try shooting them. How do I use this thing? Alright, I don't actually know how fast this goes. It would be such a colossal, colossal fuck up if I fucking missed. Oh my god, that'd be horrible. I hope it's fast. Not going to need the meat trap, nail bomb. Maybe. I'll put that up there. So, stimulant. Blast him with all my explosives. Then use my normal weapon. Yeah, I'm, I'm probably going to do the Puzzfosts, and then the can gun, and I'm probably going to hold off on the nail bomb, unless I see, like, a really good place to use it. Because I need to be able to hide behind something so I don't get hit by the nails myself. Okay. I can do this. I'm gonna die. Here we go! Fuck!
Whoa, whoa, whoa. Did I kill it? Did I kill it? Did I fucking kill it? Oh my god. Oh, oh my god. Did... I'm alive. I don't even know what the fuck happened. I just, like, clicked all the buttons. All of them. Holy shit. <laughs> I did it! Oh my god. Wow. Okay, so they do take damage, even if their their armor's plinking. You know, it, it looks like your rounds are bouncing off. They do still take damage. I have 52 hit points left. Oh my god. And I'm not even done yet. I'm not even done yet. But I'm alive. I'm alive! Also, I just noticed a really cool detail. When you take the stimulants, the uh, distortion effect, it's proportional and directional to how fast and which direction you move. Like, look, if you move slowly to the right, you can see, like, like the red, pinkish stuff is to the right of the text, and if you go to the left, the red, pinkish stuff is to the left. Right, left, right, left. Do it really fast, and it's really distorted. Do it slowly, and it's just a little bit distorted. That is a really cool detail. That is so cool. Oh, oh, fuck me. God damn it. Hold on, hold on. Meat trap. Oh, fuck. Of all things you can put into a boss arena, of course this game puts a fucking activatable stream of zombies. Of course! Why would you not? Alright, well let me put my explosive up here so I at least have something. Even if it is shit. Do I have anything? No, nope. Alright, so slowly up to these pipes. Very slowly. I might actually make it to level 6. Which would be exciting because it's something new, but keep in mind, my progress does not get saved until I reach level 7. So even I, even though I will have seen a future, uh, further part of the game, it won't actually upgrade my starting position. So level 7 is my goal before I can actually breathe easy. Ooh, armor. Hello. I can't believe I missed that first shot. It was so close. How did that miss? <sighs> Alright. I like how even the boss arena doesn't really give you anything. Like, normally there's... In most games, after fighting a boss, you get like a super chest full of awesome stuff. But nope, in this game, you get nothing. Nothing at all. Nothing at all. Not even a secret from what it looks like. Nope. Nothing. Alright, two doors. One door leads to a place with no chests. The other door leads to a place with three chests. I think I'm going there. Okay, thanks, bye. Actually, wait a minute. How do you get back? Does this door automatically unlock? It does. Okay. I guess it automatically unlocks when you finish the boss fight. Please tell me that's like the end of the enemies, right? I mean, surely they wouldn't have more enemies after the boss fight. That's it, right? Now we just walk the rest of the way through the game and finish? What is that noise? Sounds like something burning. Is that void? Ooh. Nice. Decent explosive. Let's make another can gun. And I just got ammo for something. What was that? Uh... Ooh, heavy rifle, thank you. All 
Alright, anything else? Nope. Alright, heavy rifle. Nice. Alright, what was up here in the top right? Anything? Nope. Okay. Closest chest is to the left. Nope, there's still enemies. Really? Oh, this is a big room. What? I thought everyone was dead. I was looking down at my ammo and stuff. <sighs> Gotta remember... Don't count your ammo, don't look at your weapons, don't look at your equipment, don't do anything until you're sure they're dead. I need to remember that. Alright, looks like we've got... One chest. Where, wait, I thought there were three down here. One, two. Where's the third one? Nah, I don't know. I'll find it. Alright, is this a trigger? No. Shoots three adhesive grenades. I don't want to use my tubes. Hmm. What the hell? It looks like I can combine it with two guns. Instead of using two tubes, and I guess this would only use one tube. This one? What the hell? Let's do it. I don't know, maybe it'll lead to something cool later? I'll never know unless I try. Alright, pistol ammo. Shotgun has one shot. Oh, it actually holds less ammo in the, in the clip. Because now it shoots in threes. So it holds enough to shoot three rounds of threes instead of ten, so you so you don't have one left at the end of the shot. I guess that makes sense. Although it would have been more forgiving if they switched it to twelve. But of course they wanted to fuck you over. Cool, I just need one more play, and I've got some more armor. Any secrets? Nope. Okay. So this probably leads to that chest up there, but that's a long way to go. This one's pretty close. I wonder when the hell I'm going to find the button to open up these doors. Let's go down. Get out of my way, stupid table or whatever the hell you are. Oh, oh, hello. Taser and a battery, I think. Huh. 
Can I make anything out of it? Nope. Could be neat, I guess. Could use it against weak enemies and zombies that get close to me, I guess. What is that? That looks just like a error. That doesn't really look like a secret, because I don't see any, like, breakable blocks there. Hold on, let me try that shitty pistol. Nope. Well, I can fuck right off, pistol. Hardware, can I make anything? Drum magazine. Uh, nah, I'll save it. Oh, hi. What's that fucking detector? Tells me two feet from the circle. I almost hit it, and I was walking forward with my weapon out. Hmm. What the hell? Let's test out the taser. Wait a minute, they're not coming. Tissue debiatization? What is debiatization? Okay, I guess you have to be like in line of sight to activate it. Unfortunately, I can't go through the door without getting in line of sight. This thing sucks. That thing totally blows. I do want to use it up, though. Alright, so it's not good against... If you have room to maneuver, then it's pretty good against weak enemies. But, yeah, it's not going to keep them from hitting you. That's for sure. Oh, there's one stuck. Really? Really, really, really. Okay, fine. Now, what am I going to get for all of my efforts? Another taser, a chip. Oh, whoa, whoa, wait, what is that? Hold on, let me get out of here. Fuck, so many loud noises. There we go, nice and quiet. Hold on. Shock blade, which blows, but what is this Tesla coil? Experimental ranged electrocution device. Tube, M-chip, hardware, taser. Fuck yeah, I want to know what the hell that is. Whoa. Hmm. Instead of periodically zapping, it seems to have a constant attack. This might be better for groups. Oh, let me unload this. How much does it hold? 50, okay. Neat. Well... I need to press the button, and I don't know where it is. The only place that has a chest is up here, but it's not just the chests I want. I want. I need the button. I need to progress. So I'm going to head towards the chest and hope that I find it on the way, and if I don't, well... I guess I'll just start exploring. This is disturbingly wide. I don't like this. That is very disturbingly wide. Okay, Tesla coil. 
Nice. I like this. Good against groups, definitely. Oh, shit. Holy crap, that's awesome. Goes through ammo pretty fast, though. What is this? Necrotic tissue? Oh, no, no. This place doesn't have a name. I guess it's just a yard. I can look for secrets after I've cleared the place. There is my beautiful chest. Another chip. Big explosive. Hmm. Alright, got quite a few grenades. Oh, oh, never mind. God, okay. It doesn't hold... It doesn't just hold nine. It holds them in, I guess... Amounts of three? Or amounts of nine? Uh, I'm not sure. I don't know, but apparently it holds 18. Sweet. Okay, secrets. Secret, secret, secrets. Any secrets? Hello. Alright, let's go up here. Hmm. Teleportation to non-human combatants testing. Wait a minute. Maybe you don't unlock the doors? Maybe you, go, like, go around the back? Oh, no, that's the button. Okay. Well, I'm gonna have a lot of enemies coming after me after I do this. And I really don't have much health. I've got a bit of armor, though. Hmm. Got my can... can gun. Alright, let's do it. Now, let me get to this big yard before they attack. Take out the people that shoot, and then take my time with the other things. Come on. Actually, it did make a noise. Unlike the blast doors, maybe? Maybe they won't come? I don't think they're coming. Okay, I don't think they're coming. Wouldn't it be funny if this boss room locks again and I have to fight bosses again? <laughs> that would just be so hilarious. There we go. Okay, so I guess I can't go to the other one since I didn't unlock it. I guess another place unlocks the other one, but I don't really care. Level 6, Advanced Combatants Testing. Wonderful. Let's go. I'm glad I was working on teleportation tech and not in the saw house, cutting up the bodies and joining them together again like pieces of a goddamn puzzle. 
Well, at least they're all bits and pieces again after I went through the place. The next stop is at Advanced Combatants Testing. Should be a bit cleaner place and a bit deadlier, I'm afraid. Wonderful! 50 zombies, 4 giant zombies, 2 guards, 10 red guards, and 2 war walkers. That's what I fought. War walkers. Remember, my progress is not saved until I reach the next level. Level 7. I'm on level 6. Heavy rifle. Wait, don't I already have that? Wait, is there a difference between rifle heavy and heavy rifle? Okay, there is a difference. Two plates. Make some armor. Sweet. Okay, what is this rifle heavy? High velocity semi-automatic rifle. Uses depleted uranium. Oh, okay. Well, now I have some depleted uranium. So that's different than the heavy rifle. Rifle, heavy, heavy rifle. Okay. I guess it gets heavier. I don't know. I'll use that against super nasty stuff, I guess. Anyway, I certainly don't have a lack of ammo, that's for sure. Especially with the MG. I just need health. I'm assuming that the first enemy I encounter is going to make me shit my pants. Not looking forward to this. Alright, let's get this chest. Is, is that a laser gun? High velocity bullets. Holy crap. Yeah, I'm gonna have to start dropping some stuff at some point. Uh, heavy bullets. So is that the depleted uranium? It is. Well, shit, why would I want the fully automatic armor-piercing rifle when I have the heavy rifle? I mean, unless I'm fighting, like, a boss that's just a bullet sponge? And then, maybe. Let's put that down there. Yeah, I don't want to load it into, the semi into that rifle. I mean, into the MG. I'll just have it in the rifle so that's more accurate and better for sniping. Okay. A giant laser pointer that cuts instead of pointing. <laughs> a giant laser pointer that cuts instead of pointing. Perfect description. Alright, let's see how this works. Holy crap, that goes through ammo fast. Wow. Okay, that went through six. That, oh, whoa. A giant laser pointer that cuts instead of pointing. Modded to use four batteries at once. Holy shit. Good against bosses, I guess? Sure. So if I click once, it'll use four. Hmm, wait. Does, does that mean it uses more ammo, or does it just mean that it does double the damage? Or both? I, I don't know. Anyway, move this shit down here. Uh, let me move the heavy rifle out of here. It's got five shots, but I'm just going to keep the rifle heavy up here, because it has a lot more ammo. These weapons are making me think I'm going to fight some really nasty stuff. Alright, so this is good for shooting armor targets and stuff far away with exact accuracy. This is good for something that takes a shit ton of damage. This is good for general targets, this is good for general, and this is good for up-close weak targets. Okay. I am ready to die. Come and kill me. Teleporter location marked on map. Oh my fucking god. It's so far away. <laughs> uh, okay, let's go. Whoa, this thing is weak. Holy crap. This thing's weaker than the heavy rifle? 
They used to die in one shot. Rifle heavy is weaker than heavy rifle. Uh, okay. I don't get it, but okay. Come on, I need a med kit. I do not have much health. God damn it. I have tons of armor, but I do not have much health. Whoa, 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 whoa. Something's coming. Yeah, fuck you. <laughs> the hell did I just kill? What was that? Alright, this rifle heavy kind of blows. I'm gonna move the heavy rifle back up. Let's move this down. God, there's so much stuff. It's getting very confusing. Alright, monster updated. What? What was that? Whoa. Um. What was it? The scientist? Uh, it might have been the scientist. Military tech scientist? It's kind of bluish, wasn't it? Oh, I really haven't fought that many enemies. It seems that the AI took special care when augmenting facility scientists, possibly because they wanted to use their brains for more advanced tasks than just fighting. Even so, they were given extra layers of protection and quality weapons for defending themselves. The scientists used uh, seem to be usually working on developing new kinds of combatants or tweaking teleporters. I'm afraid the AI is trying to use them to recreate the teleglitch error and open the unlimited teleportation channel again. Ah. Alright, heavy rifle, laser gun. I don't really want the laser gun as a main weapon. I'll put that down there. That's for special cases. Shotgun. What is that? Ah, some health. Whoa, God. Hmm. Honestly, I just want to get to the teleporter. Like, I'm going to run there if I have to. It's probably behind blast doors or something, though. I mean, if I fought a boss last level, I'm probably going to fight a boss this level. Hmm. Uh, anyway, let's head in the direction, at least. I don't want to go down there. Let's go to the left. Ooh, Puzzfost AP. Yes, please. Please have a med kit. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Perfect. Exactly 100. Alright, I got some more heavy rifle ammo, right? Yeah. Wow, I have a lot for this. Hmm. The facility, the facility AI Emergency 5. I'm the only one left alive from our group. I saw what the zombies did to my fellow researchers. They take them back to necrotic engineering and install them with chips while they're still alive. Fuck. And I never even got to ask the name of that cute biology scientist, H69. <laughs> or whatever the hell that is. M? I don't know. Wait, is that supposed to be the pound sign? 
I think... I think that maybe that's supposed to be the pound sign. I'm not sure. I've got a few chips left in this SMG, and I plan to reserve the last for myself. Uh, sorry, a few chips. A few clips. Whoever reads this, tell my aunt... Samus? Sa what the fuck? Back on Earth that I... Okay. I guess he died. Hmm. Up or down, either way could lead to it. Let's go up. Two shots. That's not good. I'm going to put the heavy rifle up here. Or sorry, I'm going to put the rifle heavy up there next to the heavy rifle. Could lead to the left. Hold on, I don't want to keep using the heavy rifle. Let me use this. Okay, not bad. Well, this is definitely not going where I want it to, but it does have a chest. Another medkit. Volver ammo and a chip. Wow, I am full. Nope. Alright, let's go down. Whoa, 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 something's coming through. Oh, fuck. Did I? Oh, no, I didn't activate it. I didn't activate it. Wow. Freaked out, kind of panicked, almost activated it, actually stepped into it, but thankfully I was not in line of sight. And there's apparently an enemy there? Have I not gone up here? I, I guess I haven't gone up there. Fucking patrolling... Fucking patrolling people. All right. Um, what do I not need? Oh, I've got a revolver. God, I have so many weapons. Are right, you know what? Fuck this heavy MG. There we go. Wow, I have a lot of MG ammo, that's for sure. Alright, time to go down. Yeah, the issue is not ammo at the moment, it's not freaking out and actually being able to use all of my weapons before I die. That's the issue. Um... What the hell is that? Holy shit! Are those zombies? Those have to be zombies. Right? Alright, let's use the Tesla coil on this. Holy crap. Target units storage area. Please be zombies. It is. That was perfect. It used up all of my ammo. Alright, I think there's one left. What are you doing over there? You're the oddball. Alright. Secrets? Secrets? Oh, whoa. Yeah, those are secrets, but not the good kind. Yeah, I'm not going in there. Alright, this is leading to where I need to go. What is behind there? Oh, it's that. Alright, well, that's the last of that. Back to the rifle heavy. Ooh, you know what? I need this medkit up here. Just realized that.
Hmm. Hmm. This looks like a boss arena. I don't like this. Let me take a drink. <sighs> if this is a boss arena, use this. Got my med kit. Fuck the shotgun. I can shoot it full of holes. <sighs> Please don't be a boss arena. Please. Okay, I don't think it's a boss arena. <laughs> what the fuck? D d it's a boss arena. How the fuck did that miss? Okay. Well, I'm perfectly calm after that. Yeah, that went great. You instantly sense that your injuries are fatal, and as understanding of your own mortality becomes a fact, you enter a sudden state of clarity and peace. You understand your past, present, and future. You have died. Oh my fucking god, that scared the shit out of me. That scream! And how the fuck did that rocket miss? How did it miss? I'll have to go back and look where I shot it, but it didn't it doesn't seem like I should have missed. That fucking weapon, oh my god. Okay, hide behind pillars. That is the stratagem or strategy or whatever to defeating it. Hide behind pillars, because if you get shot, you're dead. It has it has like fucking miniguns. Oh Jesus. Okay. Okay. Do I want to keep playing? Um... I don't know. What the hell? I'll keep playing. I'll be right back.